Hey everybody and welcome to the lounge. All my fellow loungers, chillers, bowlers, and grillers. In case you didn't realize, uh, I have a slight cold so I might sound a little bit different to you. Yeah, I'm at the lounge. I'm just going to do a little vlog today. Just a couple little things I got to say. Um, mostly important is uh, about Twitter. I want to just make an announcement that uh, there's been a fake, fake ass Uncle Larry on Twitter that actually made a uh, made an account so similar to mine that it's confusing everybody, even confused the crap out of me yesterday. Anyway, I'm gonna straighten this out right now. My Twitter account is Lorenz Abraham 12 with a small L. What he did was is he decided, pretty smart, is that the capital I looks just like a small L. So he put a capital I in it. He only has 21 people follow him, but he's following like 250 followers of mine. And uh, you know, I have 12,800 as of the last I seen it. And, and it's not bothering me about the followers and stuff, but the thing is, is he's commenting and acting like me, and he's responding to, to other people and confusing them. They think it's actually me writing back to him, and I'm not. Um, you know, I do try to write back to a lot of people, but what he's saying is stuff that I wouldn't say. And he's also set telling people to not follow me, that I'm fake. So I wanted to put this out there for everybody. I don't know how to stop it because I can't change my my name, my username on there unless I open a whole new account, which I don't want to do. So the only thing I can think of right now is that if you guys can be vigilant for me and actually all the subscribers of mine should type in Lorenz Abraham but use a capital I at the beginning. If you use a capital I, Abraham, Lorenz Abraham, <clears throat> excuse me, capital I for the L for Lorenz Abraham, 12, and go there and block him. And if you block him or report him, that's the only way he's going to be taken down. And then I'm sure there's going to be more to follow because this is the bullshit that you have to deal with on uh, social media because for some reason some people, some low-life scum, don't have anything better to do in their life than to pretend that they're somebody else. Um, you know, it's supposed to be the, the best form of flattery, you know, when somebody copies somebody else, but that's bullshit when it comes to this. Not when they act like them and try to uh, respond and try to create havoc for everybody else. It's a bunch of bullshit. So anyway, I just want you guys to understand that, you know, this is going to be a pain in the ass for a little while until I can figure something else out maybe. But uh, I just want to let you guys know because you guys deserve... To know who's actually talking to you guys on there and that's why I wanted to make this video because he can't do this he can't be me in real life he can only be a fake ass one behind a keyboard and shit so I just wanted to put this vlog out there for you I also came outside today because I'm feeling so much better than yesterday and the day before and I was looking at my basketball court here <laughs> let me just show it to you real quick it's a sea of leaves Well, basketball season's over anyway for me for this year, but I do like to come out and shoot occasionally, and I'm gonna have to blow all that crap out. It's that time of the year. It's what happens here when you live out where all the trees are and shit. Speaking of trees, people have been asking me about, you know, when am I going to uh, start building my deck? And it probably won't be until the spring now because I'm just not gonna have time. And the days are a little bit shorter now, you know, when I get home from work, so I don't really have time. But I have two big ass trees to take down. I'm gonna show them to you real quick. It's gonna be those two right there. Cause I don't want them to be actually hanging over my uh, new part of the deck that I'm gonna have coming out here. So that'll be fun. And I'll probably film me actually taking them down just in case you know something freaky happens like uh, the one falls on the pool or something like that. I don't think it will. I think I can drop it. I'm pretty good at dropping the trees, so it's going to be quite a, a job cutting all them trees up and everything. Maybe I can get Tom out to help me, you think? Nah, probably not. But anyway, that's uh, on my agenda. Today, I think I'm just going to do some, uh, go through my fan mail from last week and actually send out the autographs that asked me for it. And uh, I'm going to hook up my Xbox One today and uh, get that all ready to go for tomorrow. And also, want to just let you guys know, um, I have one game left to give away, and that's going to be the Xbox One Black Ops 3. 
I haven't decided how I'm going to do that yet. What I'm thinking of is actually I want to pick somebody who I know is a fan. 100% fan. So, just start any of you guys that have on Twitter. It's going to happen on Twitter, so you guys need to follow me on Twitter. It's very easy to open a Twitter account. You can do it on your computer. If you can watch YouTube videos, you certainly can open a Twitter account because if Uncle Larry could figure it out, anybody can. So anyway, just go on there and uh, tell me that you have an Xbox One. Especially, And I'll know because I, I, I know the fans. And I'm going to pick out a name that I recognize and that I, I recognize has been a good person and has been, you know, writing uh, positive stuff and, and is just a good person all around. So that's how I'm going to pick out the last one. And that'll be for Xbox One. So send me them Twitters. Tweet me. And I'll hook somebody up with a game. All right. Until next time, I'm going to grab myself something warm to drink because I'm not drinking any beer today. I haven't drank any for a couple days now because of my head cold. So just want to let you guys know everything that's going on. And I hope you guys all have a blessed day.